a long time ago, I gave up trying to predict anything, how anything was going to happen, because I realized that was an exercise in futility. Despite Frank's heart and and uh, you know these things happening from his misunderstanding of what love is and what life is, uh, I don't know if you can do the things that he's done and, and ride off into the sunset. Yeah, it's been a, a number a number of dead dead bodies piling up there, which is uh, definitely challenging. Uh, <laughs> uh, I think we deserve to be in jail. I told all of you that this was going to happen. I mean, when are we going to finally learn our freaking lesson? We can't keep expecting to get away with these things. Well, I think that some characters are going to get bad things happening to them, or ending endings. You know, I'm a big Game of Thrones fan, and so I think that everyone in the last episode should just die. Maybe because all the characters are so messed up. <laughs> well, I'd come up with a hashtag called Sam's Club, and I think as each of them die, they start to come into Sam's Club, which I think is only proper and fitting to have uh, the final laugh. But I would be a big liar if I told a story where everyone got what they deserved. That's not what happens in life. I might be paraphrasing, but there's a line in Hamlet that says, use each man after his own dessert, and who shall escape whipping? I think the idea of dessert isn't necessarily what makes for good drama, you know. So, so, to be honest, it's a question that doesn't really preoccupy me very much. It's such a dark world to live in, the world of how to get away with murder, and these two have been fighting to stay together and fighting for love the entire time, and I hope that they can get out to some ranch in Montana and have a few dogs and maybe adopt a few kids and, just be baking pies on the weekends. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if it's possible though, because there's so much real life and that's what the show deals with is like real life stuff going on that, I don't know, they wouldn't survive. <laughs> no, <laughs> nobody deserves to get away with murder. Some of them will, some of them won't. I want people to be horrified by that, but um, people in real life get away with murder. I want, you know, the audience to be left sort of with the reality of that and the disappointment that maybe the innocent people Please, don't leave me in here alone. are put away for something that they didn't do and the guilty people get to walk free.